Hi beautiful Libras, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be doing a law of attraction spread to see what's coming at you. Now some of you don't believe in the law of attraction and that's okay. Today we're just looking at the cards and see what the energy draws out via zodiac signs and via intention. So if you're looking for someone new or you're traveling on a new pathway, this is your video because it might reveal who might talk to you next. Welcome back. Thank you for all of your support as well. So we have the Romance Angels. Of course, you can always recognize this deck in any spade on any channel because it's pink and it has this huge globe on the back. It does have like, it's beautiful. I just actually really looked at it today. There's two couples hugging if you can really look inside that mirror and inside that mirror and uh I don't know why there's like so much stuff from when I cut my hair, but <laughs> there's hair on the back of it. So we have heart to heart conversations, too much information. We have heart to heart conversations there, beautiful energy. Someone might be wanting to have a conversation with you um, about their respectful feelings. Heart to heart conversations. Also, this card can be drawn up when somebody finally wants to speak out and tell you how they truly feel. Um, I feel like Libra, you know, as I touch this card, there is somebody that has been wanting to say in full how they sort of see you and how they see both of you hanging out. So I get that. It's almost like the vision for how this date is supposed to go or an idea. Heart to heart conversations. I am hearing Aquarius and a possible Aries or Taurus. So heart to heart. Okay, let's see what you have next. Soulmate right next to it soulmate energy again i'm getting aries maybe in another libra i don't feel aquarius with this card i did hear sagittarius with soulmate sagittarius is do very well with libras especially when it's a mature relationship and both people are grown we have the soulmate card there it says yes this is your soulmate okay so give me some intentions here for this new person if this is a new person for the beautiful libra what is the intention Please, Spirit, draw out the energy for us so we could read it and try to understand. The whole basis is understanding, and maybe, Libra, they can offer you something, too, that you've been waiting for. Okay, so at the top of the deck, we have honeymoon. This is a honeymoon period. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. So, yeah, I do think that they want to hang out. They possibly might want to take you on a date. This is the honeymoon card of the deck, so it does include dinners, it does include fine dining or the drive through dining, but you have honeymoon here. So good energy. I think this person so far just wants to take you on a date. We see wedding. The situation involves marriage. Maybe with this card, commitment down the road. This doesn't mean a wedding is forming in a few days. This is just eyeballing you as that type of person. Marriage material. Um, you see things in love very healthy. You respect the path that love leads you to, and you respect commitment as a whole. So that's what that card says to me. Very soon. Indications point to all road signs indicate that this is very soon. Now, as far as outreach, some of you are like, well, I already have them in my life. They're here. So what do I do, Libra Light? <laughs> what you do is it says clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. The funny thing about this card is it could happen in a couple of hours. It could happen by you, Libra, interjecting some more talking, or this person can finally come through the inbox or the DMs. So all this says is very soon could be up to two weeks to four. I wouldn't go any past that because a month would be way too long. All it says is this person's going to be flexing very soon, okay? Very, very soon here. So let's get a good shuffle. Give me possible zodiacs for Libra. Who is the soulmate energy and who's this person that potentially has a crush, okay, in large part? Could have a very large crush or keeping it on the low, very secretive. We could see through the cards if that's the case. All right, and I will read also your sea animal today, which is coming up next, okay? You had one today in the shorts, so I think I'm going to go ahead and read him. All right, it's ready, Libra. We're taking top Sagittarius, Four of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? The devil could be a Capricorn who sort of fancies you, okay? Capricorns are very good with Libras in terms of business, so they could start a project with you and they'll be very successful. Queen of Pentacles, also Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and we also see the lovers, Gemini, okay? Gemini, lots of Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well. So because you have the lovers in a new love read, 
And this is such a good luck sign. This card, if, even if you see it later on today, this is such a big indicator, Libra, that someone here has intentions for you. The devil is here so they could have toxic ways. I'm going to show you a little bit. It's upright today for your new person. So they could have things like smoking. Uh, they could like to go out very often with their friends, get into some things. All right. They could they could do donut, donuts and burnouts. I wasn't going to say donuts. Um, burnouts in the middle of the street. It's something like that. Or they could just be somebody that overly hermits. That could be a devil energy, keeping to yourself too much. The devil energy can be signified by 55 different things. So it could be that this person's overcoming addictions of their own or a past romance here. Something tells me there's a past lover uh, that's looming over or hovering over the situation with you. So they can't really come forward right now and say feelings because there's still something unaddressed. Be aware of this because I felt this earlier in the day uh, as I was calling in energies for this reading. I was trying to gauge how I wanted to start this. So give me more about their intentions with Libra. What's happening with the intentions of the new person? Are they funny? Are they exciting? Do they have something to offer here? More than just, um, you guys know, more than just the sexual advances, the sexual king of swords right now they do have the hierophant energy they do they really do they're planning and strategizing libra with the king of swords exactly how to verbalize this okay they could be standoffish too because there's not enough energy to generate more messaging more communication so that might be something on your part today that you want to do king of swords here and the hierophant torn energy they could very well be a taurus okay you also have the queen of wands here they see you as the queen of wands they also see you as the ace of swords i hear okay so channeling now they see you as someone that is highly spiritual. You might be uh, somebody, Libra, who's very outspoken with what you follow uh, in terms of tarot, guidance. Uh, you could post a lot of quotes here, or you could be a reader yourself. You read cards, you do. Um, maybe you have a business here where you're a tarot reader. So I see the Ace of Swords here as they see you as an intellectually focused person when it comes to your spirituality. Also, like you're very close to spirit and they know. They have evidence or have seen evidence that you're close to your guides. Maybe you posted something here, Libra, about your spiritual pathways. And this person has sort of seen your beautiful pictures. I'm getting it as like posts on Instagram or Facebook. It's something that you've done with your life, okay? Hit that like button if that's you because I'm getting a strong channel. We also have the Queen of Wands. So they see you as a super smelling good girl or guy. They see that you take care of yourself, uh, that you take strides to look good, to also handle business well. For some of you, you have a business that you do wholly on your own. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, many times in your reading. Also, like you could be someone that takes care of the home, very DIY. They see that you're handy with your hands. Um, or you handsy with your hands. So they see that and they sort of like that. Um, they see the joy that's in your face as you do it too. So there's something about the pride. Also for your family, Queen of Wands can somebody who's, who can be somebody who's proud of their family. Excuse me there. Okay, so let's get the last intentions here. I'm gonna switch to the Muse deck. What's the final intentions of Libra's new love? What's the final intentions of Libra's new love? Oh, I was told to stop. The magician? Are you kidding me today? Gemini Virgo for me as a reader. Okay. So when the magician pops up as an intention, they've been manifesting you. And Libra, I need you to believe it today because they're calling you in as a soulmate. They're calling you in as a soulmate. They see that you have a lot of resource. You're dependable. Okay. Okay. They do see this Queen of Swords side of you. Some of you could be very outspoken with your views. They see that, okay? Um, or maybe you talk with a very, you speak with such eloquence. You verbalize your sentences beautifully using big words, if you will. So Queen of Swords also as their intentions. They might actually want to talk to you sooner. Queen of Swords can be clarifying your very soon card. Let's get one last intention from the new person. One last intention for Libra, please. Thank you. Justice. To provide justice to your life. To bring romance to you. And also, I think they feel like you've been hurt before. They can see that you've had Libra tears. 
or that you've cried over somebody. So they could be wanting to bring justice to you in the form of a new relationship and that ends with justice. Thank you all today for joining me. This was your new love read. If you'd like any information about this reading, you can contact me at the information below. And I can also give you a personal reading based off the reading you just saw today. Thank you guys so much. I hope this reading helped and it resonated. I will see you in video too.